left. It's a little shuffle back. <laughs> Good morning. Hello. Happy Thursday. Happy Thursday. We're back. Leslie's back. Yes. So happy you're back. <laughs> we missed yeah, you. You. <laughs> you don't have to do the uh, by yourself lives. Oh, they, they're rough. They're, <laughs> it's like, because you say something and you wait for like the other person to like say the thing and you're like, it's never coming. <laughs> no. Or you're like, thinking you say something that might be kind of maybe funny mm. and then it's like, Nothing. Yeah. So anyway, get that instant feedback. Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm glad you're back. Um, it is fall. feels like yes, fall. <laughs> and it feel feels like it could snow. It does have that uh Christmas. And so then this morning my kids were asking me when it's going to snow. Mm. I'm like excited for that. I was like, ooh, if only if only to be a kid again. Right. And to be anxious for that first snow. Right. To be like, oh, is it going to snow today? But also my mind, I don't go to like the fun things for snow, like nope. sledding, skiing, skating. I go to the frozen tundra of yes. January, February. Right. So, and then the other thing that came out this morning, along with wanting it to snow, was Christmas music. No, that's too soon. <laughs> it's not even been Halloween yet. I know. <laughs> I know. He put on Christmas music and I was just like. Oh no. Mm. And I was about to turn it off. Mom, this is the best song because it was Mistletoe from the Beebs. He loves that oh, song. Oh, okay. Yep. And yep. um classic. <laughs> he's like, I just love Christmas because it's my favorite time of year. He's like, and this song is the best song because then it could be Merry Kissed Miss. Kiss Miss. Bless him. <laughs> Bless him. So <clears throat> Hopefully we don't have Christmas music between now and actual Christmas. Right. I might. Uh, like end of November. I might throw the speaker through the wall. Yeah. By the mm -hmm. time Christmas rolls around, can you imagine? Ooh, I already get sick of it in the first place. <laughs> yeah. The best of times. Yes. Um, so yes, hopefully, hopefully the snow stays off a little bit longer as well as the Christmas music. I yes. might have to put a... Um, um, Put some rules in place. Yeah, maybe like maybe just like get really into the Monster Mash for the next couple of weeks. <laughs> oh man, I haven't listened to Monster Mash in a long time. <laughs> well, maybe it's time to to bring it back. Yes, yes, resurrect it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> just as a distraction, if nothing else, mm -hmm. buy you two more weeks of Christmas free. Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay. Should we talk about what's new? Probably. Yeah, there's lots. There's <laughs> lots. Oh my gosh! Every time I check my email and I see another, like, ship notification or invoice, I just think, oh god. I was in here. I was here on Tuesday, and because I haven't been here for a couple of weeks, I was like, it is honestly like a game of Where's Waldo in here of <laughs> like all the stuff that's new. It's like, oh hey, that wasn't in that spot before. <laughs> I know. I know. There's a lot. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. First on the list. <laughs> This Another blue and creamy. Stack of, oh. So this is called Blueberry Delight from Bunny Hill Designs Bermuda. With a name like Bunny Hill. <laughs> I can't <laughs> go wrong. Oh, it's so, it's so creamy pretty. Creamy. I brought a couple. Um, and then I realized I only brought the blues. But, um, <laughs> Are you partial? <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. It reminds me so much of that um, Blue Escape. Yes. yes. Like just does. how beautiful and creamy that one was. Well, and do you remember mm -hmm. that quilt that Kim made that we had hanging back here yes. that was the creamies and the blues? Mm -hmm. Like this? Mm. So yes. I love this one. Yeah, that's beautiful. Aw. So, so like nostalgic feeling. Um, And then I brought this one because I know you love a good stripe. I love, love a good stripe. <laughs> I was looking at this, at the creamy one. I was like, that's a good stripe. <laughs> oh, that's a good stripe. And then this one I was thinking of you too for lining. Ooh, super cute. Yeah. Love, mm -hmm. it, love, love, love. And oh, there's some ginghams. You cannot, you cannot be mad at a good gingham. I think there's three ginghams. <coughs> Excuse me. So we have it in yardage, obviously. The fat beautiful quarter bundle. Fat quarter. Are there so moda bundles, are they like the factory cut ones? Are yeah. they yard? Fat yeah, quarters? they're yards. So okay. they're 18 by 21 or whatever. Not our maple fat quarters. <laughs> um, oh, jelly roll. I was trying to think of what this was. But um, it's just lovely. Yes. So pretty. 
Speaking so, of blue fabric, have you started your bedroom quilt? I have. Oh, I have started. Good for you. And I brought it. It's a lot of half square triangles. I brought it to thread therapy a couple weeks ago or last week or I don't know. Time has no meaning, but um, with the intent on marking them and sewing them during thread therapy. But mm. I got them all marked and then it felt so good just to sit in that chair and just relax and yak that I didn't go to my car to get my sewing machine. So I like that you actually remembered it this time. <laughs> didn't you? Well, last time I forgot the pattern. Yes. But yes, I remembered the pattern and my machine, but I just didn't feel like getting up. So every thread therapy, your sewing machine will get closer and closer <laughs> to the store. To the store. I was thinking maybe I should set my expect expectations lower mm. and just not bring it that I just need to bring hand sewing because mm. um, that's fair. Yes. Um, I just need to bring something that's just a little less right. effort. Right. And so then, yeah, you can just still yak. And, and then, sit. yes. <laughs> and I've also been reading a really a good book series. So that has been taking up my, uh, sewing time as well. Yes. Cause, but, and by, again, by the end of the day, when, like the kids are in bed, the options are to sit on the couch and read my book. Right. Or go so the book's been winning out lately, right. but it's it's coming, it's coming. Yeah, that's good. Mm -hmm. One of these days. I yeah. was expecting you to say you hadn't even like looked at it. Oh since no! You, so I'm. We are. <laughs> you have exceeded my expectations. Oh, good, good. <laughs> okay, next on the list. These have been in the store for since before me, and um. We oh, so just cute. got them inventoried and Rosalyn took pictures of everything and we have them up on the website. So there, it's a Japanese brand. We say Inazuma, but whether or not that's correct is um, debatable. Debatable. But a whole bunch of, of purse hardware. I don't know. Hardware is not the right word. But what? so like straps, leather straps. These the are little, oh. um. So that, the one I just held up comes in a whole bunch of different colors. I didn't bring them all, but, um, yes. I'm exploring this one because I'm just curious about, <laughs> excuse me a moment. <laughs> <laughs> and then these ones with the, with the. Oh, they do come with little pattern pieces. Because I was like, yes. and it is in Japanese, but Google Translate works wonders. <laughs> That's how we like figured out what to call them um no that's so, i mean there's the the instructions are are pictures and i mean the pattern pieces are pretty straightforward but that's so awesome so i was like oh you could probably find a four inch like pattern online but they come with the pattern. and there's a whole bunch of different um um oh, ball colors yeah. for lack of better words <laughs> um and then there's some where the um the balls are separate. <laughs> Clasps? Well, the clasp and then the balls. No, the frame and then the clasp. Okay. <laughs> or you can just keep calling them balls. That's fine. <laughs> I'm so immature. But, um, so you can choose the clasp color and then different ball colors. Yeah. Um, super, super cute. I feel like those would make really cute uh, Christmas presents. Like, yes. To make and them probably, up for people. Probably pretty quick, hey? Okay? I would think so. Um, Marilyn says they're an easy, uh, they're easy little guys to make. So. Oh, good. Um, I mean, there's like a whole bunch. So I just grabbed kind of what was on the top. Then this style of handle, like a stripper handle, which is actually um, super versatile, as demonstrated by the pictures. You could do little baskets or put them on like coat bags and stuff. Oh. And I wonder if you could, instead of sewing down here, if you could use rivets or Chicago screws. Yeah, I was going to say totally you could use, like, the little hole punch right. and a hole punch in. But also, this is, like, very um, soft. Yeah. Like, it's, it's uh, your domestic machine would be able to sew through it, like, really easily, too. Yeah. Um, so cute. So that's the... In the Zuma. <laughs> All that hardware is now... 
up and not just for in store. Only. I appreciate that Roz does all like the labors of love because I can't imagine that that was a quick I task. think it took her forever. Yeah. <laughs> there's so many. There are so many, and there's not a lot of just stock photos of it online. Of course, to get. Of course. Okay. <clears throat> Wow. The new Simply Modern, number 34, and Quilt Mania 157 are here. And I will show you my favorite product out of this one. I just love having a look. I don't know. They're just so... Is this super cute little pumpkin oh. pattern. So cute. That is cute. That is adorable. Oh, and while we're on the subject of Halloween... Oh. <laughs> Carolyn made this little guy out of um, Tiny Frights. It is so Using cute. Jen Kingwell's um, Shooting Star papers. And so cute. It's adorable. And then, and then we put some fire sign on the back so her little granddaughter could maybe use it um, as like a tummy time. The color. Smiley. Don't you just love the colors? I like do. for a Halloween um, palette. It's yeah. so just fun. I don't know. I love the neon and the purple. Yeah. Well, love it all, actually. <laughs> I mean, I, it, yes. I bought it's it. really cute. She did yes. a lovely job. Yes. <clears throat> Thanks for letting us borrow it, Carolyn. I wonder what she'll use for her binding. I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. We'll Can't have to wait, wait a while to find out. <laughs> she's on sabbatical. Okay. Um, Last thing on our list I kind of jump, is Della Q. You guys, these are really amazing. They're beautiful. So um, Della Q makes bags and this is the train case. They're, they're kind of main target audience are knitters because there's like um, a thing on the side yeah, for your yarn to come through. Like dual to do um, like dual stitching on it so when you have your yarn in there you can thread it through either side and then it's you know keeps it all neat and tidy and they aren't like sometimes companies will do like grommets but then your yarn is stuck in there forever so this is nice because it opens on the top right because if you oh. stick it through a grommet like you're tethered to the right right hmm, um, these things i don't think about as a <laughs> non-knitter um and then the top is like has these little magnets on it so perfect for the little stitch markers it comes with and the darning needle um, just really so did, clever. Did we get the orange one in? No, we didn't get the orange one. <laughs> Probably like the like only the, color. <laughs> there, I think there was two colors. Um, and I think not only, are, I think this top is. Oh, the whole. Oh, that's cool. I think cool. the whole thing. <gasps> cool. Might be on, I see. It comes with like a little bullet journal too for just making little notes. Mm -hmm. Anyways. And not just for knitters. Like you could, No, absolutely yeah. not. So versatile. So there's like. And then it's faux, it's canvas and faux leather. So it has either these handles or the big strap. And you can take this off too if you yeah. don't want the cross either or. strap. Um, a gal who was in for the um, Harrelson mm -hmm. class on Tuesday night, we were just talking about how awesome it is too to have like a hard shell case mm -hmm. for some of your projects, right? Mm -hmm. Like, um, or like for needles, like to know they're in something like that versus like poking through a bag or right. that sort of thing. Yeah. So we got the train cases, and then we mm. also got the little buddy case. And um, so these are just um, mostly for like your little snips or your needles. Again, and this is magnetic on on both sides. Oh, fun! And you know me, I'm a sucker for magnets. That's brilliant. Um, <laughs> are you? <laughs> so um, okay, we'll show you. So we got the train cases and these little buddy cases in five colors so this is the teal mm -hmm. indigo maroon sage and purple do you have a favorite so purple is that your favorite which one's your favorite <laughs> actually i think either the teal or the indigo oh okay i like also, the sage. i love how soft this faux leather it really is. is lovely like it's so nice yeah um, They're really great. Yes. So new little fun things. To, and especially like as we start thinking about Christmas gifts. Mm -hmm. um, 
Yeah. And I thought that these were very reasonably priced. This was one of the things that I wears welded when I came in because it was sitting up there. The train case was. And I was like, oh, holy shit, that's so cute. And uh, I was like, oh, dang, that's going to have a little chunky price tag on it. It was $100, $116, I think, which I'm like, that is mm -hmm. really reasonable. Mm -hmm. um, and so cute. We were saying to you on Tuesday night that they remind us of those little um, uh, vanity uh, like train well, yes, things. yes. And then we all uh, shared our stories. I feel like everybody over the age of like 30 has like interacted with them at some point. Mm -hmm. And my mom's friend, Rhoda, she had this pink one. It was part of like this whole set of like hard shell things. Yeah. Anyway, she had a little one that was pink and like had the pink, pink satin pockets mm -hmm. and, and like the little mirror in it. Yep. Anyways, <clears throat> she had gifted it to me and I just felt like the queen of the universe with my little pink trinket. Mm -hmm. So that's what it reminded me of. So to see them, yep. I was like, it just made me feel so like nostalgic. And ours had like the thingies here to open it mm. and lock it. Ooh, mine was front. Had like oh, okay. two little front mm -hmm. buckles. Anyways, I thought that they were very yes. cute and classy and just reminded me of happy times. Yes. And I, I love these. Mm-hmm. Because most of my stitching is done in the car. Mm. So, and um, the magnetic part of it is so cool, right? Because if you like, if it rolls off your lap, it's not like, oh, shit. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so, yes, Stella Q. And now I'm like, damn it, why did I didn't get the orange one? <laughs> <laughs> What's what in the other two train cases? Yeah. What what was what were the other colors? So there was orange and I think there was one other one. I can't remember what the other color was. Surely it wasn't pink, because otherwise no. Always. If there was a pink, it would I would have not. <laughs> it would have all been pink. It would have only been pink cases. <laughs> so yes. Okay. And then one little quick update before we go. Hi Tilda Hibernation. Mm. Allison has been cutting and folding till her fingers are raw <laughs> and almost there i think today she will finish the happy holidays quote which is the one with like the stockings and santa and like so cute it's the biggest one so it's the it's the last one but these are we just have a few left of the goose cushion um they're so kits which come with the little the buttons which are like kind of my favorite part I and also then, think that that's so reasonable, like $45 to just, here's your little kit, here's your little things, and you end up and with it's super cute. pretty, well, just skimming the directions, pretty right. easy. Right. Pretty quick. Yeah. Yep. Super cute. And then um, the berry wreath, <laughs> which is like, there's five meters of background, so they, how do you, how do you package that? You package it like this, like and this. it looks great. <laughs> yeah. So um, there's a few berry wreaths left, and then... Um, and then, yeah, I think there's also a few happy holidays left. If you feel, feel like you missed out or you're on the, on the fence about it, there's just a few left. So I think that's all for today. I think we did pretty good. Mm -hmm. Lots of goodies. Yeah. And as always more on the way, besties will be here soon ish. I need the bunnies, all the bunnies, all of the bunny yes. fabric. Um, so, oh, also, really quickly, I know you talked about this, um, mm -hmm. but Kim's class for this, I, oh, yes. I'm contemplating signing up for it just because I feel like it would be so fun. This is the coolest. It is, this is it the is, coolest. It is a great bag. I also wear as well though this. <laughs> and it's, it is so fun. It is. And I feel like if you, I feel like if you are like even new to bag making, this would be like a pretty good one. Because I think a lot of the Biani patterns are very intimidating. Right. Especially for like newbies. Um, but this is like so manageable. And a good way to like a good starting product for a biani. Because then you yes. know how that directions are written totally. and kind of what she means. And um, yeah. yeah, and just so fun, like and just such a useful um little bag. Anyways, mm -hmm. I was like, that is I actually bought a bunch of stuff to do it and I'm now I'm just waiting for the patterns to arrive, which I assume are on the way. Yes. <laughs> I know. Um yes. Um, no, I bought a bunch of stuff. I was going to make two. So. Yeah, it yeah. did go a little. <laughs> I was like, oh, that looks like fun. So. Well, you picked out one with Duval. Yes, Duval. And, and then, then picked out a ribbon and was like, well, I also need this yes, one. Yes, so do we have that ribbon handy? Oh, um, yes, no, it's somewhere. You're just telling me to remind people about finishing school on Friday. That's oh, right. Yes, Thanks, yes, Edith. Yes. <clears throat> finishing school tomorrow with Edith. Tomorrow night. Yes. So, <laughs> really good little way to come in and just finish up projects we're mm -hmm. working on and have the help of Edith nearby, which yes. is always much appreciated. Yes. <clears throat> okay. 
I think that's it for today. We'll see you next week. Yes. Have a great week. Bye-bye.